Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna to be making a video about how I keep my skin nice as a performer. The skincare regimen that I use to keep my skin looking so nice, if I do say so myself, through six weeks of stage makeup and stress and a different environment and you know, mic tape and all of that. And all of these are cruelty-free favorites, by the way, I know a lot of you guys that, that matters to you. So FYI before I start, they're all cruelty-free. We'll go backwards, we'll start with moisturizer, okay. So hyaluronic acid is a very effective ingredient. It's a humectant, it draws moisture into the skin, it plumps up the skin cells, and it can do wonders for the skin. A lot of people use them in serums, but now there are moisturizers that have that hyaluronic acid built in. And the one that I use is the No BS Day and Night Hyaluronic Cream. And in addition to hyaluronic acid, this moisturizer has jojoba oil and apricot oil. So I love, first of all, the fact that it's a day and night product. A lot of companies I feel like target they make different moisturizers for day and night when really the ingredients don't differ that much and maybe there's a difference in texture with some kind of you know thickener that they've added but it's really not a difference in moisturizer but i kind of like two in one products i've never been one to use you know a day cream and a night cream if anything in the day i use my spf but i still always use a moisturizer because i do have combination sort of dehydrated skin. So the texture of this moisturizer is light. It's almost like a gel cream. Um, it absorbs into the skin very quickly, which I like, which makes it great for a day cream. Like, boom, it's gone. I don't really smell a fragrance. Uh, there's no fragrance added. No BS, their whole thing is that there's no BS in their skincare products. There are no synthetic fragrances, harmful and toxic ingredients, uh, anything that that's just not good for you and unnecessary. They don't put in there. They just put in the good stuff. So on their website it says, many people think our products are organic or purely plant or purely plant-based. The truth is we've hit the sweet spot between a mixture of nature and science to create potent formulas with clean ingredients. No fragrances needed, no harmful chemicals necessary. No BS also partners with some pretty amazing organizations. Right here I see She Recovers. Uh, they support women on their path to recovery and as well as Feeding America and Project Glimmer which inspires at-risk girls and women to believe in themselves by letting them know their community cares. And also Lotus House. Lotus House serves the Miami community as a shelter for women and children in need. So you can feel good about buying products that are good for you as well as buying products that help give back and that's something I am proud to promote here on my channel. And I'm so excited that NoBS is the sponsor of today's video because they're an ethical, sustainable brand and effective products. This is a star in my skincare routine. Another one is the Derma E Anti-Wrinkle Renewal Cream. I'm already at the point where I'm using anti-wrinkle products, anti-aging. Ugh, where does the time go? But I love how big this is, first of all. Big container. The texture of this is great. Uh, it's thicker than the no BS moisturizer. So if I need a little bit more, I need to feel super, you know, almost like wearing a mask of moisturizer, I use this one. And, uh, but it also looks great under makeup. It's not that heavy. The thing about this one is it dries matte. So it was different than what I was used to wearing super oily, creamy moisturizers. It still dries matte. So it moisturizes you, but it's not greasy. Um, and the, the vitamin A is basically like, Retinol comes from vitamin A, so it helps with cell turnover, it helps with fine lines, with bumps on your skin, and I have not, I mean, not fingers crossed, knock on wood, I have not struggled with the skin bumps that I was so frustrated with for a long time now, and I think I can attribute it to using this. Um, because I just think I have such fast cell turnover and I need help regenerating those cells and getting the dead skin off, but I don't want to scrub all the time because I also have sensitive skin. So this will always be, always be in my medicine cabinet uh, or my drawer, whatever. Yeah, amazing, love this. Now for my serums and little treatments, those come right before I put on moisturizer. I love the Pharmacy Honeymoon Glow AHA Resurfacing Night Serum. And this was something I had for a while and I couldn't use for a little bit because my skin was just really reactive and sensitive at, at 
a certain time I'm not really sure why but now I'm able to use it it doesn't hurt or burn but if you have sensitive skin or sensitized skin it might I will just say that but when I put this on at night I wake up and my skin looks insane like I look like I have glass skin so I absolutely love this it's a great serum you can feel it tingling so you can feel it working and again it just it resurfaces the skin it regenerates the skin cells and is a chemical exfoliant and I love it my other serum that I highly 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 recommend and I really think my skin started turning around to a crazy level when I started using this like crazy I have the best skin of my life right now and you guys know I did the videos with proactive and that really helped to clear up my acne but now I'm working on my skin texture and the luminosity of it and the hydration of it and of course it's a combination of things I've been eating really healthy I've been having a lot of omega-3 fatty acids in my diet a lot of a lot of water a lot of tea uh, been exercising but my skin really started to take on a new form when I started using this this is the Mukti vitamin booster vital B elixir and this is a uh, certified organic ingredients and this is an Australian brand and I don't know where I found that maybe I think I was looking for a serum with hyaluronic acid and I believe this has a natural form of hyaluronic acid um, but yes I was looking for a natural serum that was effective and this has so many good reviews and it's balancing for the skin because I do have combination skin so it kind of helps balance the oil production and I notice a difference if I stop using this my skin is like oily shiny um, it definitely helps balance my skin it improves the skin texture my skin looks plump in the morning after I apply this and this is my favorite serum I think I've ever used ever 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 so this will also always be in my arsenal even though it's quite pricey and it ships from Australia that's the price of beauty right and then I know a lot of people use scrubs on their face but like I said I hardly use them just because my skin is so sensitive and it really only helps to take off surface dead skin like flakes for treatment I really love the dr. Dennis gross alpha beta daily extra strength daily peel so it's a two-step system this size I believe is exclusive at Sephora um, it's also vegan and I bought them during the VIB sale so that you know a while ago so that I could really get a discount but there are 30 plus 5 bonus treatments oh so 35 treatments and it comes in this box and they're individually wrapped which you know not great for packaging but also really great for travel and I'm not sure how else they would do it unless they put the pads in in a container but then that would kind of let air get in and out so I understand um, so you have your exfoliate and smooth and then your anti-aging neutralizer that you do three minutes later so they come in these packages and it's like a little facial wipe like a mini baby wipe and you rub it on your face you can totally feel it tingling totally feel it working uh, chemical exfoliants this is what this is all about and my skin texture type and just what I want my skin to look like it responds very well to this and then you do the neutralizer which I think kind of just keeps you from drying out too much from the acids so it's super easy very quick something great to do before bed before an event or um, just to treat yourself I love it it feels luxurious and very effective right after I cleanse I use a toner which I don't always use but recently I have been using the honor MD tropical mist it's a pH balancing toner with papaya sage CoQ10 and hyaluronic acid so just give me all the hyaluronic acid I love that the second ingredient is aloe I love a mostly aloe based toner or facial spritzer just because that's so hydrating um, the ingredients are literally five lines long it's time like I know all of these ingredients and uh, the products are free of parabens phthalates sulfates and synthetic oils and fragrances cruelty free and in a glass container and this was actually made uh, a family friend of mine dr. John Diaz he and his wife Ursula created the honor MD line and they're not paying me to say any of this or talk about it but I love what they're doing they're making effective skincare but it's clean and this smells incredible also incredible I always look forward to putting this on I love how big the container is it's four fluid ounces but I really don't like douse my face in it 
I just use a sensible amount as a toner and it's just so luxurious and fabulous and I'm gonna give you an in-depth review of the Honor MD line because I am trying out the full line because I do want to see those effects and share them with you because they're a new up-and-coming company but been loving the tropical mist absolutely loving it it just adds a little bit more hydration you know so i love to feel hydrated and and nourished after i wash my face and this is amazing it cleans off the rest of your makeup my my towels have no makeup on them once i do the oil cleanse followed by this this will always be in my arsenal as well i adore this so mad hippie cream cleanser you know i think the baseline, the foundation of keeping my skin looking nice through stage makeup and stuff is cleansing. First and foremost, you just can't have that gunk on your skin. So I uh, owe my clean skin to, in part, to the Mad Hippie Cream Cleanser. Now for cleansers, this one has been wonderful. I do a double cleanse. I do an oil cleanse first, especially when I'm wearing stage makeup. You just have to, like micellar water, a makeup wipe, not enough, not enough. I need to see nothing on my towel or my skin will be a mess. So I've been using the Mad Hippie Advanced Skin Care Cream Cleanser. And I had seen Mad Hippie products for forever at Whole Foods. And they're really cute, but I think because of their packaging, maybe I didn't think they were effective enough. Like, this is something that grabs my eye. Like, this looks medical. This looks like it's gonna do some positive damage to my skin. Like, it's gonna get things done. Um, I tend to like more of like the pharmaceutical looking packaging just because as a consumer it makes me think that it's going to be more effective oh, this is so good this is so good if you have dehydrated dry combination skin or even acne prone skin because it's really not like oily or it doesn't oh my gosh i love a cleanser that doesn't make me feel stripped i need that oh why am i not drinking my tea it's probably cold by now as my first step in my skincare, I use an oil cleanser. And you guys have seen this if you watched my post-rehearsal skincare, post-rehearsal routine. But it's the Palmer's Cocoa Butter Skin Therapy Cleansing Oil. And Palmer's is cruelty-free. I love that. Uh, it has a nice, light, rosehip fragrance. No mineral oil, no parabens, no phthalates. Good for all skin types. This is an amazing oil cleanser, and it is affordable. It's available at the drugstore, which I love. And it just... Mm, I love the texture of it. It's not too hard to work into the skin and it's also easy to wash off. My issue with natural oil cleansing like coconut oil, it's not made to emulsify. It's really not made to splash water on it and it starts washing off. That's, it's not really made for cleansing your skin. So when I've used coconut oil, I always feel like there's a little bit of a residue left and my skin is not that clean or I have to use a very stripping foaming cleanser to get all the oil off. And then, whoop, this is not that way. I adore this. This will always be in my arsenal. It's affordable, cruelty-free, <laughs> just flipping my hair everywhere, and very effective. So absolutely love this. Yeah, this pretty much does all the, the hard work, the dirty work. This is the workhorse, can I say work more, in my skincare routine. And this was, uh, you know, this combo was amazing for getting my skin clean from stage makeup. So that's my current skincare routine besides me testing a little bit of the Honor MD system, slowly integrating those products because I just love trying new skincare systems. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you found it helpful. Let me know if you like or try any of these products. Um, and once again, thank you to No BS for sponsoring this video. I'll leave all the info below. Check them out. They've got a beautiful range of skincare products and they're very transparent about their ingredients, their ethics, what they stand for. I think they're a super amazing, super inspiring up and coming company. So definitely check them out and uh, check me out on social media below. Please subscribe if you haven't and I will talk to you soon. Mwah. Bye guys.